All right. This is on slow. This is 25 frames per second. CPU time is, is pretty high, but it's not as high as it was. It's eating a good 60% of the CPU at this point, which is much better than 90%. Well, that's not actually true, Straga. It, it would be possible. If I was in a better area, then my bonded would get probably get five up. The problem is I got bonded ADSL, which is two lines. But if I had... Have I even gone back on yet? I have a feeling X-Split's being a bitch again. <laughs> I am? Okay, cool. Yeah. All right. Great. Well, yeah, I'm not seeing me, but as long as you... Ah, goddamn stupid bloody dwarves. Anyway. Yeah, so bonded ADSL. Yeah, it's... You've, you, now you realize the difference between 25 and 30. Yeah. That's what it is. That's... A, any gamer can see the difference. Any gamer. Yeah, if it's choppy, you'll notice... You notice the dropped frames. Especially if you've just been watching 30. Far to waste. It works, and it might be slightly better quality, but as you said, it's it's an issue there with the the frame rate is is non ideal. So we're gonna go back to the preset we went with earlier. And there's one other thing I'd like to try, which is full screen game. 30 FPS with the slow preset. See if it can cope with that. If it can't, we'll go back to the setting we had, and then we'll just leave it at that, because that seemed to work pretty well. Okay. Be right back. It may also be an, in, uh, an issue with the fact that DX Story doesn't capture at 25 FPS. It only captures at 30. So, it's having to downscale. Which is kind of annoying, but let's just 